now they're getting some crickets. We give them lots of different types of bugs. They get crickets, mealworms, waxworms, kingworms. Crickets are one of their favorites because they like the opportunity to chase them down. So the meerkats were off habitat for about three months or so. Um, and that was because we were building a whole new section to their habitat and expanding their indoor space. Um, and their large habitat over here also got a bit of an expansion. Have you seen them here before? No, never seen them? Yeah, well this whole portion is brand new. We not only wanted to give them a little more space, but we have some meerkats who don't get along so well, which that happens a lot with meerkat mobs. And so this gives us the chance to have both groups of meerkats out and visible to the public and doing what they do best and digging. Digging is the main thing that you will see them doing. They do that for a good portion of the day. You will also see that um, one of them typically sitting up and kind of looking around and being the sentry for the group. So uh, digging is mainly what they do. They like to dig burrows all day long. Um, and then the lookout kind of looks out for predators. A lot of time you'll see them looking up at the sky since hawks and eagles are their main predators in Africa. So they make a lot of different sounds, a lot of different vocalizations, and they mean different things. So there might be a bark for an alarm call, there might be a bark to just talk to each other, and scientists have even found that meerkats can recognize individual voices, just like you guys might be able to recognize each other's voices. So they can do the same thing. These are our two females. Um, so the one who's uh, standing up on the logs right now is Priya, and the one wandering around is Leslie. We have five meerkats in total, so we have uh, two males and three females, and you'll typically see the two males and one female together, and then two females together. I learned that meerkats have really good listening, and they can tell what, vo what voices there are, like rec can recognize voices, like of people, of other types of animals. I think they're one of the most exciting animals to come see at the zoo because they are active for such a great portion of the day and they do enjoy this cooler weather so um, they're a great one to see uh, this time of year.